I want to talk James Harden, though, who was also so insanely efficient last night. He actually broke the scoring system. Seriously, <laughs> neither the NBA's nor the ESPN electric box scores could keep up, and they had to be corrected later. It only took James 35 minutes to rack up 56 points on 25 shots. He didn't miss a single shot in the first quarter. And oh, by the way, this was against the Jazz, one of the top defenses in the league. James also had 13 assists, which gives him 91 points created total. That is the third highest ever in NBA history. By the way, he is also number two on that list. Um, Kevin, this is also with Chris Paul, still out with a knee injury. Can James do this when Chris gets back? Does he want to still be doing this when Chris gets back? What are we looking at here? I think the probability that he's going to do have a night like this when Chris Paul gets back is very slim. I also think they'll probably be more likely to win basketball games when, when Chris Paul gets back. I mean, listen, they're playing this way with Harden because they don't have anybody else on the floor who can really dribble with the exception of Eric Gordon. They don't have anybody on the, on the floor that can make passes, unlike, say, the Warriors who play their way, not so much because they can shoot, but it's the ability to move the ball, all five guys, that generate a fluid offense. You're going to, but here's 631. You're going to have 631 dribbles when there's one other guy on the team who can dribble the ball. So James Harden is one of the most efficient players of the efficiency era in the NBA. And out of everything that he's done, this is one of the great command performances of his career. Yes, I think it's responsible to ask about Chris Paul. But let's just take a minute and say 35 minutes, 91 points created, 25 shots. Say that again, 25 shots to get 56 points. When Will Chamberlain scored 100, I know they didn't have a three-point shot, but when he scored 100, he took 63 shots. When Kobe had his incredible 60-point game, his last game of his career, he took 50 shots. That's twice as many shots as James Harden did. I know that Chris Paul coming back is going to be a, an integration issue, but oh my God, this was James Harden at peak James Harden last night. Brilliant performance. And just, I mean, all of Daryl Morey's dreams coming true right there Seriously. with that shot selection chart. Amazing.